Dr. Chris here with the Ask Dr. Chris Show. Today's question is quite topical and not one that I'm asked often. Somebody's wondering whether they should can choose to have a hysterectomy, uh, when, whether it's medically indicated or not, to prevent uh, the symptoms of menopause and hormonal imbalance. It's a really good question, but I think you have to weigh up the risks of having a hysterectomy and the surgical risks versus obviously going through menopause. Uh, and the symptoms of menopause are not actually related to uh, whether you've got a uterus or not. The symptoms of menopause are related to the hormone changes that happen as our body runs out of eggs as women. And so the hot flushes will remain whether you've had a, a hysterectomy or not. Um, in, in the case of menopause, the sleeplessness, the irritability, the mood changes. So unless obviously hormone therapy started. So having hysterectomy won't uh, ameliorate or change any of that. The, the time when a hysterectomy is medically recommended is when there's obviously situations where cancer is indicated or there's heavy bleeding that can't be solved in any other way um, or there's severe uh, prolapse. So there's, there's situations when a hysterectomy may be recommended medically, but in terms of voluntary or choosing to have it done to avoid some of the menopause symptoms, uh, that, that won't, won't help in any way. So thank you very much for your question. It's, it's a topical one and, and certainly one that I think people would have thought of before and wanted to ask, so that's great. So thank you very much. If you have any other questions, please jump onto my website, drchris.com.au, and I look forward to answering them on the Ask Dr. Chris Show. I hope that you're loving the Ask Dr. Chris Show. If you would like to see more of the Ask Dr. Chris Show, please press subscribe.